By now, I'm sure you have heard some of these taglines. The fourth industrial revolution, the great reset, and the great narrative. And of course, you will own nothing and be happy. And I'm sure you've seen the face of this guy being praised as a visionary who will guide our world into a prosperous future. But what does that really mean? And what is the World Economic Forum's plan for the world in 2030? Will it be a world of increased inclusion, equity, and freedom for all? Or as many people fear, will it be exactly the opposite? I'm not here to answer that question, but what I would like to do is propose a hypothetical future scenario. A scenario that the WEF is promoting and the type of world we could be living in by 2030. A world where your property, your identity, your money could be owned and controlled by your government. At the end of the video, I do want you to make up your own mind whether you think the WEF is a force for good on the planet or if we should be having some concerns and if we should be asking some questions. So let's get into it, shall we? But before we do, we do have an amazing newsletter that people rave about. 60,000 people and count. If you want to join a fellow in, in the bio. To make my case today, I am going to be speaking the three main clues that surround the world economic 2030 and discussing some of the things that they are promoting around the now famous event called the Great Reset. Before I start though, I just want you to keep in order to transform the planet that we live on. Secondly, all of the resources that I'm sharing in this video are coming from verifiable sources, many of which are directly from the WEF's website. If you want to confirm any of the information, there is more info in the description. So let us discuss the three hypothetical pillars and how it might affect our lives. Pillar one, surveillance. The first pillar in the 2030 agenda is the possibility of total surveillance of every single one of us. And the way the WEF could achieve this is by us requiring a new form of identification. The World Economic Forum suggests that every single person on the planet will receive a new form of digital ID, which they say would help promote a world of inclusion where everyone has more access to basic services. But they also suggest this ID could be linked to absolutely everything in your life. It could be required to book plane and train tickets and track where it is you're going. This digital ID would be needed to access social media, the internet, bank accounts, and even a requirement in order to spend your money. And without your ID, it's possible you may not be able to buy anything at all. And who would control your digital ID and the data it contains? Well, of course, your government would. In short, absolutely every action you take in your modern life could be tracked by this new type of personal ID, what your online habits are, where you go, what you buy online, what you say online, and so much more. And if you The laser has no function. Attention. 
Attention. Attention. Attention.
Why, look at this. Um, gender fluid pride. You, I saw it on the stream. It means, um, like, um, well, you can still use them. Dad? Yeah, I know. It's just, I saw um, you use that one. Well, that's why I used the gender fluid one. So I really see you used a gold Oh, look at those. Look. Say that how you get them, but I mean, is um, wow, look, they're great. I like that one with the eyes there. Cool. It's a nice guy. Yeah, you like that, not? I like the one with the eyes and those ones. Can I go and get no lollipop? Well, if you're going to find one, but I think they've all been eaten now. Mm -hmm. I found an empty box. Who's been eating I all the lollipops? Um... Can I go and get no lollipop? Well, if you're going to find one, but I think they've all been eaten all the lollipops. Can I eat the other one?
Look at those eyes! Oh, what's that? Don't waste the phone. Alright, let's change this lock. Come on! I'm eating my breakfast. Why doesn't it? He's getting everything he's saying up. 
Right, look at it now.
Self-imposed incarceration Disposed to self-abuse Squeezed by despotic meritocracy 
swim in the sea against the tide of wider economy. The circle within a circle, where time takes on a new calendar. Open up a new dimension, a kind of mental extension. Let time wander for a while through the fields of yonder. I own on my own. Am I on my own? Am I own anything? Own own own. I own only my own time. I am own a lot of nothing. No thing is my own. Only borrowed on loan to look after snail shell that can get too heavy to carry if you keep on accumulating. Alas, I amass too much. It is my vice. I am ground up. Wound up, but my tick is too slow. There is nowhere to go where I feel I know what to do in this fiscal zoo. I'm permanently locked in the loo. It's like gravity, it's like depravity, it pulls you down but then it keeps your feet on the ground. I guess at one time the whole universe was a mess. But the universal dream has given way to the universal scheme. Get your application in soon. But sometimes the absurd can still be heard above the clatter of serious matters and the drone of the hard drive that drives us mad on the infinite information highway. I've got that feeling where I can't quite touch the ceiling, stretched Strong, highly strong stone crows, that's how it goes. All going well, can't you tell? Stretched, strong, highly strong stone crows, that's how it goes. All going well, can't you tell? Unhook ourselves from mental entropy. the role of every circlet in the great internal combustion engine of modernity.
Circumspect and total correction. Snap those chains of domination. Self imposed incarceration. Disposed to self abuse. Squeezed by despotic meritocracy. Swim in this sea against the tide of wider economy. The circle within a circle, where time takes on a new calendar. Open up a new dimension, a kind of mental extension. Let time wander for a while. Of yonder. I own on my own. Am I on my own? Am I own anything? Oh no, 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 I own only my own time. I am own a lot of nothing. No thing is my own, only borrowed on loan to look after. Snail shell that can get too heavy to cut. 
carry if you keep on accumulating. Alas, I amass too much, it is my vice. I am round up, wound up, but my tick is too slow. There is nowhere to go where I feel I know what to do in this fiscal zoo. I'm permanently locked in the loo. It's like gravity, it's like depravity, it pulls you down but then it keeps your feet on the ground. I guess at one time the whole universe was a mess. But the universal dream has given way to the universal scheme. Get your application in soon. But sometimes the absurd can still be heard above the clatter of serious matters and the drone of the hard drive that drives us mad on the infinite information highway. Now I've got that feeling where I can't quite touch the ceiling, stretched Strong, highly strong, stone the crows, that's how it goes. All going well, can't you tell? Unhook ourselves from mental entropy. the role of every circle in the great internal combustion engine of modernity.
just a bit
the cash, cash. Economy. economy calls out, out for resurrection. resurrection. Thank <laughs> you. 
civil society, the private sector, independent experts, as well as philanthropic, academic, and international organizations. We're starting with the basics. Today's guiding question is, as Dr. Mahjur said, what substantive elements do you think should be included in a new international instrument on pandemic preparedness and response? I repeat. Substantive What substantive elements do you think should be included in a new international instrument on pandemic preparedness and response? We look forward to hearing from you. The success of the future instrument depends on it. Ultimately, whatever instrument comes, this process will affect everyone. Ultimately, whatever instrument comes, this process will affect everyone.
station. Frankie.com, I have the t- Frankie.com, 
I have the two. The world. Can't stop saying the quiet part. Can't stop saying the quiet part. They're about to, and I. Money and accounting, and introduce a new one. They're about to, and money and accounting, and introduce a new one. Who is Pippa Malmgren? Um, my Harrison Ford himself. Well, um, my strong stomach to pl himself. An hour video. I made it two hours before I need. An hour video. I made it two hours before I need. Who would have thought it? Davos.
for chasing the sparks that fly through the sky. I, I, I wonder why it will not spin dry in the casino economy, quite as high as you want it. Gambling den. And then again, the books always need balancing. Trapeze or please give me time to pay. Balance the books of costs, of reason, philosophy, religion, and fiction. Welcome. Welcome. In another year, for before we know it, they have all gone. And we are back to the beginning of time again. Get the measure. Get the measure. Get the measure of post bad modernity, revival and survival of its raggy influential form. An ability to inform with inference and argument, a challenge to overt debt laden capitalism and dragnet market imperialism, a catch all dumbass belief that best equals most popular.
that precise and absolute exchange of value from one state of balance to another state cause total imbalance imbalance can we track it down in time in time time Ultimate transaction theory. The straw that broke the camel's back, the feather that started the crack in the floor of the warehouse, where the whole house collapsed from all the weight of hoarded gold and items waited to be sold. Pause at the causeway. forward and back, between the white and the black of the game on the board. The rewards of sticking it out are unpublishable. A trouble machine of dream statistics and hieroglyphics that seems terrific until you translate the weight of the message. Winners and losers fight it out for all the glory. Attention seeking in a leaking crate of great expectation. Life is not fair, art is all hot air if you don't care to wear a life jacket. Less than the beginning. The corners curl, the dimple creases into being, and all of a sudden you are grinning like a baby. The tale of two systems, two of many, but these two are chosen by fate to relate one state and its rate and step it down to another. Veritable voltage selector for fate and fact interact with fictional prediction, a crazy contradiction of strangely dubious depiction that needs unpicking like a fabric vest for a tragic quest of consequence and circumstance. Yes, point your finger at the sky and ask yourself why it rains and it rains all over this story. Thank you. 
invisible strings that oscillate into notes as hard as nibble right through to the other side. Just what a little mouse needs to feed its family. All three thousand of them sharing space under the floorboards.
Class box set, mind and match. A scratch card suited style of raw expression. Press or touch or swipe your type in the credit rated cat system. I'm listing my company on the Beef Stock Exchange for it rates the greatest cheese that melts fast. I'm listing my company on the beef stock exchange for it rates the greatest cheese of Ah!
So it's vital that we get the widest possible range of inputs. Thank you all for your engagement at this historic moment. A change, a chain, change age, a different ratio of intellect, of circumspect and total correction. Snap those chains of domination. Self-imposed incarceration, disposed to self-abuse, squeezed by despotic meritocracy. Swim in the sea against the tide of wider economy. The circle within a circle, where time takes on a new calendar. Open up a new dimension, a kind of mental extension. Let time wander for a while through the fields of yonder. Yes! My own, on my own. Am I on my own? Am I own anything? I am own a lot of nothing. Nothing is my own, only borrowed on loan to look after. Snail shell that can get too heavy to carry if you keep on accumulating. I am asked too much, it is my vice. I'm round up, wound up, but my tick is too slow, there is nowhere to go. Well, I feel I know what to do in this fiscal too. I'm permanently locked in the room. It's like gravity, it's like depravity, it pulls you down but then it keeps your feet on the ground. I guess at one time the whole universe was a mess. 
nothing but the universal dream has given way to the universal scheme. Get your application in soon. But sometimes the absurd can still be heard above the clatter of serious matters and the drone of the hard drive that drives us mad on the infinite information highway. I've got that feeling where I can't quite touch the ceiling, stretched Strong, highly strong stone crows, that's how it goes. All going well, can't you tell? Unhook ourselves from mental entropy. the role of every circlip in the great internal combustion engine of modernity.
Dad. 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 Yeah. Where are you? I don't know why they give everybody a card. Wait, what about that thank you card you made us? Ooh. Can't get into that right now. Right. Right, I better get on. Wait, who's always outside? Hey? Who are the people outside? Go and see, quick. Go and have a look. Break down. Piece of paper and I'll have a look. I don't want to see it, I just put it on a bit of paper. Like it's got, it's got like a print on it. Like a picture. Oh, very cool. Dad, look how many pieces. Dad, look how many pieces. Oh, yeah, that's cool, yeah. One piece is missing from this. Oh. And this part is all ready to finish, so we need to find the other part and size and put it together and then I'll make the piece. Very good. Thank you. 
Well, I'll have a look at it. I'll have a look at it later. Don't you yeah, think about having a car, though? You've got to move it. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute.
the legacy of this meeting, of the negotiating process, and the pandemic itself is a healthier, safer, fairer world. Uh huh. Mm, not on me. Wow. Wait. 
Wait, Tom, could I go around to that 